No, it's a it's a yerba mate. Mate. I mean, yerba, yerba mate. Oh yeah, bless oh. you. I like that stuff. Yeah, it's a, it's I've a, never even heard of this stuff. It's a tea. Oh, that's yerba. why yerba mate. Yeah, my the funny thing is my my brother he's like it's not officially a tea. I'm like, yeah, I don't. It, it's something <laughs> steeped. Yerba is steeped, and so tea. Huh. Huh. Interesting. I like it. I think it's a it's a good drink. It's refreshing. Um, does it have caffeine? Mm-hmm. All right. I believe so. So it's like ten ten thirty p.m. and you're down to the caffeine. That's okay. Well, I won't die. I know. Just uh, just looking out for your sleeping <laughs> habits there. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Some people don't get affected by it. I I don't typically. Rare, yeah. I mean, sometimes I'll I'll drink something late and I'm like, oh crap. Yeah. <laughs> He's all, oh crap. Oh. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's kind of funny. Um. Uh. Like oxy oxy cotton or oxycodone, whatever. You know, it's like I had a broken foot or something. And uh-huh. they, they gave that to me. That yeah. stuff does not mix well with me. Oh. It makes me like a hyper hypo. Really? Oh my gosh! Huh. I will sit in the living room all night, I'm like hoo, 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 hoo. on oxy. Yeah, wow. and I just like rock. I'm like a crackhead on it. It, wow. it does something really weird with my metabolism. Like it just, <laughs> I it bring out like some kind of latent ADD. <laughs> That's like, awesome. Do you remember um, Saturday Night Live had a skit with uh, Mike Myers and Hyper Hypo? Yeah, he was like attached to the the jungle gym. Yeah, that's how I feel. Like, yeah, <clears throat> internally. Yeah, you it's not a good. You couldn't sleep on it or anything. No, there's yeah, like any of that oxy bull crap does not work well with me. I'm uh I'm also otherwise afflicted with those uh, with Vicodin and oxy. I just immediately vomit. Really. Yeah, I mean it'll be in my stomach for like five minutes, and then really, it's, then it's out. Yeah, so I had I, I think with my surgery on my leg like a long time ago, they were no no it was uh, kidney stones, oh. and they were like like oh let's let's try um, Vicodin, mm-hmm. and uh, I tried it I was just vomiting which is a lot of fun when your kidneys are like, sure. hurting, and then uh, and they're like well maybe we'll switch you over to Oxy. And I was kind of, I was looking forward to, whoa, he's throwing Yikes. I was looking your for, phone. I was looking forward to a couple days off. I did a thing. Of work. You tweeted. I did. Wow. This I did tweeted. a thing. It took me a little while, but I did a thing. Uh, we'll talk about that here in a second. I was, <laughs> I was looking forward to a couple days off of work and just like chilling on my couch, like, you know, chilling on uh, yeah. painkillers. And uh, so they gave me Oxy and they're like, and I was doing the same thing. I'd throw up. Like we'll eat like a eat a lot. Maybe it's just not you know. So I, I so I down. <laughs> so you have a lot of chunks to, <laughs> to get up. So I downed an entire Chipotle burrito. Oh no! <laughs> Took the oxy and like five minutes later, it looked the same coming it up it was, as it went down. Like, like like if I threw up in a tortilla, I could have just wrapped it back up, <laughs> and, and nobody would have known any different. Just so, eat it later. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's like, a bit. Uh, that's a bit of city. <laughs> A little tangy. Uh, see, I, oxy does nothing for me. Really? Yeah. Like that. That was when I, last time I had oxys. I was like, "This is stupid." Can I get some um, eight hundred milligram Motrin? Yeah. It was just one of those things. Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't like actually dull pain or. It, it didn't do. I didn't feel like it did jack. Huh. For me. Yeah. Huh. Um, I ended up giving it to someone. <clears throat> Whoa! Just admit crimes right on the air. No, they wanted it. They're like, "Here you go." I was like, "Oh, whatever. Here you go." They only give they only give you like four or five. Like, no, that's true. They, they are really. Yeah. Um, you should have snorted them. And see oh how God, that, no! See how that worked? No, no. It, like it, it was. <clears throat> oh, they man. give you a few and like here, do these every whatever hours. Right. I was all. This is garbage. Can I get something good? Yeah. What's yeah. good? I'm like, Motrin. Okay, here you go, you idiot. Yeah. <laughs> you get to trade opioids for. Uh, Basically, it's just well, well those things like like people puke. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. They do. They did nothing. I felt like they did nothing for me. Yeah, and I was not interested in taking them. Was it something that you were like in pain and it just didn't, didn't broke help my tailbone? Pain? Oh, it didn't help the pain though. No, nah. You yeah, fall off a bike or something? Or your ice I did. I used to have video of it. Ooh. Um, it was a mini bike. <laughs> I popped a wheelie <laughs> on a mini bike, okay, and uh, yes, um, but nice. it broke my tailbone. And uh. they're like, "It's broken." Like. Oh, what can you do you with it? Do, They're like, yeah. here's your donut and here's some oxy. I was like, oh, okay. I mean, it, that that part sucked. Yeah, um, but no, I was like, 
They, they give you like five oxies and like, here you go, you'll be good for the week. No. No. Stupid. Huh. So. huh. Well, good to know that when uh, top three get so successful that we're touring the world that we won't, you know, one of us won't get lost to uh, an oxy addiction. I don't understand yeah. that. Why? <laughs> what is so it? One, what, one what? guy will be puking in the corner. Yeah. I'll be pooping my pants. <laughs> and, and, I'm, and I'm wondering normal. what the hell's what's like, the whole deal? Like, what's wrong with you guys? <laughs> so what, what is it about it? Like, I think it's just like euphoria. I think it's, sure. like, it's like it's like calm euphoria, like disconnection from reality. Wait, what's the deal? With, why is oxy so good? Or supposedly so good. It's an opioid, so it's addictive, and it's uh, it gives you like a euphoric yeah. kind of feeling. Supposedly, it d- it stayed in my stomach for five minutes. I have no idea what it feels like. <laughs> okay. I don't know. It, it does weird things to me. No, there was nothing euphoric about feeling like you have ants crawling. All I guess over that's your why. Skin. That's why. I, that's why I'm so disconnected <laughs> from everything. I'm like, what do you mean? What can I just get a Motrin? If you like oxy, tell us what it does for you. Right. <laughs> no, cause, no, because that's normal. I've heard of that. Of the puking. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You're weird on the pooping. I, it, no, oh, he, no, no, he, he was no. just like jittery and like yeah, it was awake. Bad. Oh, see, I, that's just I guess yeah, it is. people are weird. Like, like it. it's meth- like everyone's different yeah. or something. Everybody. Yeah, my mom, you're she would take. Down. She had to have like some of the. She because she do a, have a surgeries towards the end of her life, and like the drugs that she would have to take, because uh, everything else she was like you, she would puke on most of it. Oh, so yeah. she would be on like some crazy Darvocet X something or I don't remember what it was called, and then. Um, she couldn't do, uh, like, K, K, what's the K one? Uh, Ketamine? Ket, yeah. She couldn't do some of those. Uh, like, so she had some weird things with the, uh, I think, I think I the only thing I would ever really kind of want to try, um, is like, you remember Pri- Saving Private Ryan? They yeah. always hit them with like a little morphine little thingy. Morphine. Oh. I would totally like to try one of those because like in, you know, in the forties or whatever. Yeah. It felt like they were like. Watered down. It was probably like yeah, the full real deal. Industrial yeah. strength. Morphine. Yeah, you're like, and your stomach is outside your body. Here, have some more. Yeah. Come on, this is great. Yeah. I'm ready to go and find Jerry. I, I think it's about the one thing that I'd I'd like to uh, try is like a interesting like hmm. while your stomach's inside. No, no, I'd like I'd like body. everything to be okay with <laughs> everything. A normal. Stub Would you like toe. us to blow off your leg first? No, no, no. Oh, a stub yeah. toe because that, that hurts a lot. Yeah. The oh, that does, that hurt. That does yeah. really hurt, and that could use some morphine. Like <laughs> medic, medic. <laughs> Here you go, and like have this guy like run up to you, like <laughs> rip the thing open and stab uh, it in your yeah. foot or whatever. Walking that around, would... that's you know, no pain like stepping on a Lego at three a.m. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. Oh, oh god. But morphine, morphine's an opioid, so you know, it, I don't true. know. Is it? Yeah, I, I think if you. Why do you it, know all this drug stuff? Because he's, he's a drug addict. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I, no, I don't know. I, it's funny because speaking of Lego, Clementine stepped on a Lego the other day, yeah, yeah, yeah. and she was bawling. And I was like, "Now you know what it feels like, kid." Yeah. <laughs> no, no, like, oh, it's okay. I was just like, "Now you know." Now you know how I feel with now. Why Legos do you think I'm right? always telling you to pick the Legos? Up? Right. Well, welcome in, guys. My name is Paul Prosize. We got Josh not on Twitter, Anson Young. How we doing? I'd be better on Morphine. Yeah. <laughs> Matic. <laughs> Matic. When I wrecked my motorcycle um, oh, at La Hunta and like yeah. ripped off a bunch of my thumb, I did pop up and yell medic. Did we, you? we were playing a ton of like Battlefield during that oh, time yeah. period. Yeah. And it was just like, because I always play as a medic in the game. And so when I needed help, that was what my mind said. Just yell out medic because that's what you do in the someone's game. Gonna, and I was going to come running. I freaking yelled medic and grabbed my hand and ran over to the, uh, the EMTs. Oh, they're man. like, oh, they're like, what is wrong with it's you? Oh my god, your thumb! Oh, our man. time to shine. Well, hey, Josh, die. If somebody's listening to the first time, how would you describe this podcast? Oh, garbage. I mean, uh, <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> there you go. I'm so great. At this. Um, I don't know. It's a cross of like three idiots talking, and yes. um, absolutely none of us making any points that are solid. True. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, we talk about morphine, apparently. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm the village idiot because I apparently don't pay attention to a lot of things. True, true. Uh-huh. Which is true. We're true. not arguing. Um, no, I wouldn't argue either. <laughs> um, I don't know. It's uh, it's entertainment for your ears. Okay. Okay. So, but ha- describe like the like the theme. The, the theme. theme. Like, oh, how well, do we go about this? Well, what occasionally we, we bring stuff. Sometimes someone brings everything. And then occasionally we have no idea. We haven't done a grab bag in a while. 
So that's true. Uh, oh, that's true. Yeah. Like we'll occasionally go uh, bug someone at a store and say, "Hey, would you put X Y Z in a bag? Um, ring it up, I'll pay for it, and then I'm not. I'm going to look at it three hours later, yeah. and then we find out that we're drinking." What, uh, Clamata? Yeah. Gas station beers. Yeah, gas station Look at that beers. episode. That's a great that, that episode. That is a great one episode. Of, it's actually one of the top um, downloaded it's episodes a classic. that we've had. It is so good. I mean, the, the uh, what was it, the Picante? Oh, so, oh bad. so bad. But anyway, like, we just do random things, and then we start to rate it and figure out, like, who's going to win. Sometimes it's the best. Sometimes it's the yeah. best of the bad. Yeah. We rate it in our top three, which yeah. that's where our name comes from. Yeah, so. imagine that. And sometimes there's And there's more. three of us. Yeah. And we've known each other since we were kids, and we've been around. Since we were three. Friends. <laughs> yes. okay, that's totally a lie. 15, 16, something like that. Um, hey, so True. if you want to find us on the internet, go to top3.show, T-O-P, the number three, it's like Joe W, um, is our social media yeah. handle, and you can find us there and um, connect with any of us. And um, Anson, where, what's your social at Young Anson on Instagram. And then Josh, you just ignore him. Yep. Actually, he did a thing. He tweeted today. I did. So oh. I did a tweet. So if you want to find his Good Twitter, job. it's easiest to just find top3.show on Twitter. Yeah, because I don't or even top, know my Twitter. Yeah, it's, um, Wait, no, I do. Yeah, oh, yeah, at, yeah, you do. Uh, yeah. No, I, I think, just I think it it's up. on the Twitter app. Um, it's uh, J-O-S-H-N-O-T-O-N-T-W-1-T-T-E-R. What? Oh wait, no. That's actually that's actually not right. <laughs> no, because it's at J O S H N O T O. Everybody knows it's at T W one T T R. There you go. T T R. Wow. <laughs> I, Were you drunk I, when he did this? No, no. I, I, I it was too long, oh, and so I just yeah. was like, "Well, we don't need the E." Josh, not on Twitter. Oh, Twitter. Okay. Anyway, yeah, I, I tweeted. I don't tweet very often. I try to tweet something, but I did. You did it. And I didn't have to delete it and try again. Amazing. (laughs) And I even tagged uh, top three. I was going to hashtag stuff or pound sign things. You are going to pound sign things. I was going to pound sign (laughs) things. Very nice. And and I was like, nah. (laughs) Nah, that's too advanced. That's stupid. Wait till next week, dude. Don't strain yourself. Oh, man. But if you want to connect with us, do that. And then um, please rate our show. It is a pound sign. It, yes, it, it, yes. We know. We, we know. are Zennials, technically, right? Is that the, our official term? I I'm a D. Know. I think I'm still, I think I'm a whatever is before that, Gen Y. Yeah, I'm. I'm I think 70s. I'm, I'm not the millennial. 70s. We're in the 70s. Yeah. But there's that like four or five year gap that they're, they made up some new term for. Cool. Yeah. That we're all in. I'm that guy. Whatever. Sure. Yeah. Like we did know a time before the internet, right? And then there and are it people, was great. It was people who, which we reminisce about on the show quite often. There's lots of yeah. episodes of oh, I 80s know, like and the, 90s the 80s cartoons. show, like um, Slick. He called us out on a couple, and I he did. I oh yeah, he he's kind that. of he's not right because he's never right. No. <laughs> um, you won't admit it, but hey, he uh, for Knight Re- Rider Re- and Re-Runs. A-Team? yeah, Re- Re- Knight Rider and A Team. Oh, um, and right. he's like, the hollow deck and the Oculus are not the same by well, any means. We know that, you dumbass. I know, but he's an idiot. Yeah. But like, How do, yeah. like we and know this is what that. we do. We, the people that interact with us, we call idiots. Yeah. But we also have known him for quite a while. Um, and yeah, I still want the hollow deck like Star Trek. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. I would never come out. <laughs> like with forget. the self clean, and I added. If you were in the For- Discord, you would have saw that I actually added. Also, needs to be self cleaning, yeah. yes. <laughs> sterilized, sterilize it. Yeah, I, I'm <laughs> stickied. No, you walk, just, in, you walk into the first. I just want to see. I, I want to see what? a Star Trek. That's okay. the blood of my foes, jerk. <laughs> that it could be that too. Yes, it's just viscera everywhere. <laughs> You take that Klingon sword thing in there and just yeah, oh, that'd be great. Just chop up puppies or something. Do you think? <laughs> <laughs> do, wow. do whatever you want in there. Puppies, puppies. really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Poop on my carpet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was gonna say like, do you think like they they chop their vegetables and then go to war with the same thing? Oh, or, yeah. or go to war and be like, oh, I'm hungry. Klingon Cut those vegetables. <laughs> Okay, maybe it's meat. Maybe it's a yeah. worm of something. There you go. A worm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's a big, giant worm. Just make up something. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, come on. They get the lizard, the green lizard guy that throws <laughs> rocks. Yeah. I want. I. I, I want to see like like somebody needs just to make like a cyberpunk like dirty underground gritty version of Star Trek, <laughs> where like 
like like the holodeck shop, you're like indebted for life because you're like keep you you're addicted. You can't get out <laughs> of there. They're them. like like Jameson, you owe me twenty seven million credits for that holodeck usage. And you're like, I'll get it to you. Just let me use it one more time. My, <laughs> my wife's in there. <laughs> And he's gonna run the juice on you. Yeah, yeah. The oh. juice is running. He's running the vig. Oh. oh, good times. All right. So, what are we doing tonight? <laughs> I don't know. Holodeck yeah. fantasies. Oh, oh well. Well, puppies. Uh, you, see. <laughs> you you apparently want to be a Klingon killing puppies and poop on your floor. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. So we're doing uh, summer beers. Yeah. So oh, these are summer? these are beers that you enjoy in the summertime. Yes. Which. Uh, you know, there are different genres, different yeah, right. seasons. Mm-hmm. Yep. Uh, I don't want a pumpkin ale ever, but if I'm, I certainly don't want it in the summer. That is not true. You like your pumpkin ale. Actually, I did like our pumpkin ale episode. Yeah, mm-hmm. that was good. That's episode three or four. Uh, it was so. early on. Yeah, it was really four very. Four or five. Yeah. 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 So, pumpkin, or, uh, pumpkin ale episode. No, this is a summer beer. Did you beer. get through your pumpkin bar? I did. Oh. Yeah, I had to buy a new one uh, yesterday. Cause you like oh the pumpkin bar? <sighs> no, I. Uh, oh, I, I was gonna say I, wow. I, I got through all of them. The pumpkin I, spice latte. I had like three or four of them, and I finally ran out. So after like a, a year. Wow. Um, I did rebuy the bourbon one. The, the okay, buff- the buffalo, buffalo trace. trace. Yep. I really want that smoky one. Whatever the, the gunpowder one. Yeah, I really want to try that one. Um, but, I like uh, smells like or productivity or whatever the white oh. bar. I haven't, had, I haven't had that one. Oh. I have a naval, naval supremacy that is... Uh, that one's really good, That's too. my favorite. That one's good. Yeah. I, I like the white favorite. one. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's like... A, I think uh, it is like productivity or something. Yeah, like something like that. But it, it is... It's one of those ones like... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Yeah. So Well, now they sell it like Target, Lowe's, Home Depot. Like You can get really? Duke Cannon like, everywhere. Oh. We use yeah. the, the hand stuff. Oh, okay. Um, the working hands or whatever? Yeah. Um, it's really good. Nice. Like, Whitney just keeps buying them. I'm like, okay, well, I'm not going to fight you <laughs> on that one. Yeah. If my junk is chafed, would it help with that? Or... Hey, guys. Paul Prostais here for Built Bar. And I just want to talk to you just real quick about the awesome um, products that these guys have. Now, they've got a whole line of really good things. They've got some drink things, and, and they've always got discounts going on. So I would highly encourage you to look at the website, built, new URL, built.com. And then if you go to discount, if you need a discount, use my promo code Paul, P-A-U-L, at the checkout. But what I would love to briefly talk about is their um, their product. And this is my personal favorite. It's the raspberry cheesecake. When they come out with these specialty flavors, I snap this one up personally. I love this one. And they've they've got bites. These bite-sized flavors, For personally, my wife throws this either in her purse or my kids. My kids love these size these sizes because they're snack sizes or they're just on-the-go things. They grab them when they go jump on their bikes and go run around in the neighborhood, that kind of stuff. Um, Every bar has 15 to 19 grams of protein. They have real chocolate, extremely low sugar. And they've also got, um, like I said, the drink things. Um, They've got broth. And I'm just, that means I'm telling you, this company is really awesome. There's so many options on the website, built.com. Promo code Paul. Check them out today. Built.com. New URL. URL. Built.com. Check them out. Paul at discount um, and the options at the end of checkout. Built.com. Promo code Paul. We'll see you soon. Uh, we'll talk about it later. <laughs> mm. All right, so summer beers. <laughs> right, um, anyway, up. back to All the... Right. I'll go first. All right, Paul. Um, so I was thinking about, um, beers I like, I mean, I, I like a, um, a Corona on a hot day. That, yeah. That's a good thing. Um, I, you know, I mean, typically when you think of in quarantine, yeah. <laughs> um, when you, <laughs> when you think of summer beers for me, I normally <sighs> think light, um, yeah. um, sometimes, uh, fruity, you know, la- last two episodes ago, three episodes ago, I did a Rattler. Mm-hmm. So, you know. That was a light beer, fruity. Like I kind of think of those kinds of beers. Yeah. In the summer, it's because um, like you know, Stout Month is January, February. Yeah. True. 
So, I mean, those are more hearty that warm you up and kind of make you feel full and mm-hmm. that kind of stuff. But so for this, I um, I really like this uh, brewery. Oh, look at you, uh, you uh, basic little. Yeah, and I I actually really enjoy these. Um, so does my dad. Like he just figured found out found these out a couple oh, weeks really? ago. Oh, and he's like, oh, these are so good. Oh, yeah, where are these I've, all been? I've <laughs> had this this for a li- long time. This is Lyndon Kugel's um, Summer Shandy, and. Um, it has a lemonade, um, and it's a Weiss, a, a wheat beer. Lemonade and wheat beer. So it's actually very similar to a Rattler. It basically is a Rattler. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I even picked up the lemon version Ooh. of the Rattlers that we had last time. I didn't bring them. I haven't but, had Summer Shandy in years. But um, I, I really enjoy it. Like, if I'm at the ballpark in, in uh, Coors Field, Field, this is, I'll grab one of these. There's actually a, they have a corner that has a lining Google. Really, little thing, and so I will grab those. Yeah, this is. Uh, I don't. I don't, actually don't know if I've ha- ever had one. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I remember um, when Lenny Kugel used to be like really rare here. Okay. Um, and I had someone tell me about them. And they're like, "Oh my god, Lenny Kugel!" And I was like, "What the hell?" Yeah, I have a a buddy that their whole family's from Wisconsin, and yep. so they would bring these down all the time. And now you can get them everywhere. Yeah, I passed by well. like I passed by them at the grocery All store. The time, yeah. I passed by them at the liquor store. Yeah, I know what it is. I don't know if I've ever like cracked one open and have one. But now that I have, I get it. I mean, it's literally like lemonade and beer. Beer. Yeah, yeah. Simple. It is <laughs> no. I and so yeah, and what I've done it, I've made my own. Like I've had just a wheat beer and a lemonade, and I just mix it, and that's a really good, it's a really good combo. Is that all? That's all it is. Yeah. Just. Huh. Made in a beer. Yep. Oh, let's see. Well, a crisp, refreshing <laughs> beer. Perfect for the summer. Inspired. What's the uh, alcohol on it? 4 2. Yeah. All right. So certainly crush it. Yeah. Yep. So if beer you're with lemonade, and it was always a hit. <laughs> if you want something that doesn't have like a sweet kick to it. Yeah. But it has like that lemon flavor to it. Yeah, and it and it's yeah, a, yeah this so the shandy it really is a, is a rattler basically, but the shandy, so rattler, Westbury, yeah. it, it's a German thing. It's a Munich thing. Wouldn't, wouldn't the wouldn't the um, rattler have like a syrup instead of a right, uh, right. like full on lemonade? Right. So that's the difference between a shandy and a rattler. I'd probably like the 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 rattler better. Yeah. I mean, this is good, but I almost brought it for comparison, but I figured we were already doing a lot of busy <laughs> things. 27 beers. Yeah. So it's a bit lemon, lemony. Too you lemony. You don't, you don't like lemon. I'm not the biggest it. fan of lemon, yeah. but uh. it's not bad. I mean, it's not bad. It's, yeah. There's nothing wrong with it. Yeah. I think I'd rather have an orange. Oh, based. Don't they have like a, a few different ones? Yeah, uh, I think so. So not just lemon, but they have something else. But like yeah. like a blood orange shandy. Ooh. Yes. That would be dope. It does exist. Or a blood orange rattler. Mm. Blood orange. Yeah. Those, Those are, are pretty good. good. They're really weird when you cut them open. Like they, <laughs> I cut one open for uh, Clementine when she was younger. She's like, what the hell? No. Did you just murder a bunch of cu- puppies with a Klingon sword? <laughs> well, I mean, that's your, that's your holodeck fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who's next? Can't wait. Well, Anson has the next two. Oh, uh, okay. Do you want two years up? I don't care. Sure. Josh made me buy his. <laughs> I was busy cooking. That's true. Oh, all right. Ooh, you went to Walmart? I did not. He <laughs> went to Jared's. It was just in my car. It was just an easy thing to do. Have all you right. had mine before? I probably have, but you have. Yeah. I, I love these. Uh, these are delicious. Yeah. Um, so, ugh, this is a this is a summer beer, and what's funny is I had, um, so I wanted to do Blanche de Brussels, um, which is a another beer, but it's hard to find. And the last one, um, I, I bought a four pack, a couple four packs for my neighbor, and he I was talking to me. He's like, "Oh my god, they're so good! I can't find them." I said, well, I got one more in my basement. <laughs> I was like, let me go get it. And he's like, are you serious? And so he was. Where did you find it uh, here? Did Davidson. you find it here? Dave, um, oh, there's a couple of places. And I, I bought back in the day um, in, oh, oh, it probably would have been um, 08 for my birthday. I bought a pony keg. Oh. I, have, I have the actual tapping uh, that, that is needed for that keg. 
Um, and so, yeah. Oh, you probably all want one. <laughs> I totally didn't. Well, sorry. Here you go. Um, and I didn't roll mine. Anyway, so yeah, yeah, we couldn't get this, so I, I got the next best thing, which is a hoe garden. Um, so it's a it's a wheat beer um, with coriander and orange peel. Imagine that. What did I just say earlier? Yeah, or uh, uh, didn't even think of that. So um, it, it is a great beer. It is different though. If you don't like the coriander flavor, yeah. coriander that's uh, cilantro, isn't it? Coriander seed. Yes, it is uh, cilantro. Yes. Um, it, it, like it, it's got a very distinctive flavor. Um, okay. It's a good color. It's a white beer. It's huh. a cloudy white beer, so you've got to roll it like a blue moon or un, any unfiltered. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, I don't know. I, I love it. Um, Wendy had one. My mom and Wendy both tried a hoe garden the, the other night, and they were both like, "This is absolutely disgusting." What the hell? Are you really? Doing? They hated it. Oh, they hated it. All right. I and I was like, it. "Well, good, good bitches. More for more you. for me." And my mom slapped me, and I was crying. <laughs> Yeah, they've they've been around for like, since the 1400s or something like that. Yeah, it's a Belgian beer, um, and, and Blanche de Brussels is along the same line. Um, well, that's good. I can't really taste the coriander, but I don't see why this wouldn't be good. I mean, it's like it, straight it's up. Got, wheat. It's, good. It, it's that that tanginess or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. It's I think it's a delicious beer. Um, these are I always drink these during the summer. Like this is something I'm going to drink in the summer and be fine with. So, all day long. All day long. Ho, he's hoeing his garden. I'm a hoeing. Wait, uh. <laughs> where's where is this from? Belgium. Belgium. Okay. Mm-hmm. So it's a Belgian style. It's wheat. naturally cloudy white wheat. It's only four. It's four nine. So it's not like it's not coming in um, heavy. Yeah. Yeah. I all like right. it. Anson, oh. how about yours? All right. Mm. Anno. Uh, Fourteen forty-five. Oh, there you go. I didn't see that. It's a good year. Anno. What, what's that mean? It's the year or? Yeah, Anno. Okay. It's like that game play. that we play. That was fun. Anno. Uh, what was that? Eighteen <laughs> hundred. Yeah. Thanks. There's right. like twenty different versions of it. I don't know. It was years. great. That's true. The, the the last one, the the old time one, which yeah. is a lot of fun. Yeah. I do want to try the one that was before that. That was like. 21 Futuristic. or something. Yeah. yeah, 21. You're like on moon, the moon and shit. <laughs> All right. So <laughs> when I well, think I was of... Say, uh, I didn't see what you pulled out. Uh, nothing yet. Um, when I think of summer, uh, summer beers, I'm usually like thinking of like being out on the paddle board or like after a hike or in the sun, like Wait, mow, you do those mowing things? the lawn. Sometimes. When? 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 I don't know. You want to go paddle boarding with me? Where would we go paddle boarding? Aurora Reservoir. What do you do? You paddle on a board. Well, you get on the board and you paddle. Actually, what what we do is we'll we'll have like far, four or five, six people with paddle boards. We'll have a cooler on a few of them. We'll kind of go out somewhere. We'll kind of tie them all together so it's like a kind of a flotation ring. Okay. And then we'll sit on the edges of them and we'll bust open some some things. So like truly, we'll do. Uh, White Claw. <laughs> Who are these people? Something easy. Um, so, like, Stacy's brother and sister, um, one of Wes's friends' parents uh, go out there sometimes with us. But uh, we don't go, We don't go like, a ton. It's not like we're out there every weekend. But it is fun to go out there a couple times in the I, summer. I would try. All if right. you give me an invite, I would try. All right. I don't know if I like it. The water still scares me. <laughs> Aurora Reservoir is pretty, pretty f- clean. Like, like, there's no motor boats on it, so you don't get, like, gasoline. The largest fish in Colorado was caught there. See, and, that's and they what do, they do it. There's no, stuff in there. Quincy. They, it was caught by Quincy. Oh, like Quincy. Quincy. Yeah, okay. sorry. Huh. They do have a sunken plane in there Why? for scuba divers huh. to go uh, check out. Interesting. Wait. So they have a scuba beach, and they, uh, yeah, you can't see through that water. I'm oh, sure that they're, so like. So what's the point? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think I think with, like, powerful lights, like, it's, like, you could probably see like six feet or something, but mm. um, but yeah, they're out there on the on the far end. There's a scuba beach, and they'll grab you know they'll, they'll bring all their scuba gear. They'll go in there. They'll they'll check out the sunken plane, and they'll do their thing. But see, I have no like I want to go scuba diving. Yeah, um, but I have no desire to scuba dive in dirty water. No, because <laughs> like no. It, you know it, I look at it like you're in their realm. Yeah. <laughs> 
there. And so, like, I want the water to be so crystal clear so when I see death coming, I'm like, oh, God, this is going to suck. And then just let it happen. Time to die. Yeah. So, I, so you know, the, the moral of the story is I'm either drinking something really light um, or I'm drinking not beer. So, like, something, like, super light, like a, like a Truly or something. Um, or I'm drinking a sour. So, I brought mm. a sour. Ooh. Nice. Like and I that. couldn't find, like, like I don't have, like, a favorite sour that I'm always just like, yeah, that's the one. Um, I think, like, this, like the sea quench, like. Did you pick some of that up? I didn't, but. <laughs> I think I think stuff like that yeah. uh, is really good. That's Which is weird because those have, you know, since we've started this show, those have actually come into my rotation of, like. Yeah, yeah you did not like no. the idea of it. In fact, you poo-pooed it. And then oh, you drank poo-pooed it. And no, no it. I, I love them. They're so good. Now, Josh isn't going to like that. I, I, I was looking for a sour. And then you got I, I a sour up the, IPA. I picked up. No, so that is another thing. I'll drink. I'll, I'll drink, like, hazy IPAs. But you guys don't like hazy, so I, I went to a sour instead. Um, so I was looking around. I found one of my favorite breweries. Uh, <laughs> oh, I thought we wait. Um, I thought we well pooed and well works. So we, no more. <laughs> oh, cherry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so I got a cherry pie sour. But I thought uh, we poo pooed and said no more well works. You did not. Just you for one episode, never. we only did that. Oh, one whole episode. Yeah. Wow. But I I love sour sour beers. And you uh, love cherries, and I love cherries, and I loved weld work. So it so was a match made. In, it is in Greeley, <laughs> a match made in Greeley. <laughs> Perfect. So yeah, oh, we still need to go up to weld works. We do, and Funk Works too. Wait, yeah. no, what's the other one there? Um, Wiley Roots. Riley Roots. There you go. We need to like call them and say, "Hey, we do a podcast." That's right. That's yeah. you. That's the media guy. That's you. Oh, that is some cherry. I know how much Josh oh, likes cherry. God, that is very cherry. It's sour. God, it's like a sour cherry. Cherries are gross. It reminds me of medicine. It. Oh, it does. How dare you? No, it now, totally now does. Now it reminds me of medicine. <laughs> <laughs> It'll probably so, taste like medicine. Oh, we, <sighs> Remy's like cutting teeth or something, and so we were giving him meds. Um, and he was just like, we gave him something the other night, and he was like, I want medicine, I want medicine. I'm like, oh, my God. Rub some whiskey on his teeth. That's no, right. so I, got, I went and got him a uh, uh, vitamin, like a gummy vitamin. Nice. And cut it in half, because that's what he gets. And I was like, all right, here's your medicine. We're going to give it to you. Now you go to bed. Okay. Plop down. I was like, you nice. Oh, Placebo. Total. Um, all right, I'm going to try this. So, it think of think of just like sours, you know. Anson brought sours, sure. A sour <laughs> cherry pie. Oh, he, he just falls to like it. Oh, I don't like it. I do like it. That's oh. good. It's not super sour though. No, it's not sour. God, it smells so bad, and it's not medicine-y, at least to me. No. It's just gross. Yeah, it, it has like like it has that crust flavor too. Like you can kind of taste that yeah. crustiness. It's sour. <sighs> you know what it you know what it reminds me of really? Cherries. Which I just loathe. Yeah. But maraschino cherries. That's yeah. like that's what I'm getting from it. You loved really? those when you're a kid and you got nope. them in your Roy Rogers never, or your nope. This is uh yeah, that does, never this like, doesn't remind me of that. It it so it reminds me of maraschino cherries in a pie crust. Yeah, you definitely could taste the pie crust. That's oh, yeah. kind of cool. I like when the beer. Yeah, but like, that's Welders. They always do that weird yeah. shit. So this is sour ale with cherries, vanilla, milk, sugar, graham cracker, and natural and artificial flavors. Yeah, it's crazy how prevalent that graham. Plus, it's is. uh, wait, what's the ABV on it? Four eight. Is it? Oh, it is four eight. Yeah, I, was saying, I swear I saw it. I wasn't just pulling yeah. it out of my butt. Four eight. So yeah. I enjoy uh, sours in the uh, in the summertime. Yeah. Hmm. So on a paddleboard in the middle of Aurora Reservoir. In the middle, yeah. Sometimes I mean, I've been on a uh, paddleboard once. I did it. Um, there's some lake up in the mountains that I did it on. Yeah, Evergreen it was or something. I don't or know. Dylan. I don't know. Yeah. When you went, took me to a wedding. Nice. And you went paddleboarding. Uh, somehow I got pulled. I don't. I have no idea how I ended up out there. <laughs> All I, all I know is that I didn't want to fall in the water because it was stinking cold. Yeah. There are, there are, yeah, there's mornings like that. If you're out there early. Wait, you're doing this in a morning? Sometimes, yeah. Well, like, if you go, uh, you want to go a little early so that you can beat 
you can have a place to park and you kind of have a place to uh if you're gonna like set up on the beach like you want a place usually Mm. we don't we'll just put everything on the board so like your keys your your wallet, your phone, whatever else you need. Oh, perfect that for a lake. Like a, I was going to sound the other Well, no, it's like in, a really it's in, uh, bad idea. It's in waterproof uh, floating bags, you know, all that. So if you have, like, dry clothes or whatever, just kind of throw it all in there. The cooler goes on there. Uh, Does the cooler some, float? Some, or some, is it? It, it just straps onto the back. Like, I brought my soft cooler before. It's just like a soft-sided cooler that you just... Um, Carabiner. Yeah, but what happens when you fall over? Oh, you, like yeah, I'm not like falling over. No, you, like like the whole the whole. I'm the, so good. No, I no, no, like like like, like like the the whole board doesn't usually flip. Like like if you fall off, usually it's just you. Huh. <laughs> and like everything that's on there is like strapped in. So okay, so yeah. as you can tell, I'm I am a uh, veteran. It's not on like the a water. surfboard or something where it like would tumble or something. Like like if you're like super careful, like. I've probably fallen in, I don't know, a handful of times. Don't and you that, And that's just because I'm messing around. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll, we'll jump in the water, but, oh, okay. we, but we won't, like, we're not. Actually, Wes and his friend would play, like, joust. So they would, like, speed their paddle boards towards each other and, like, <laughs> let them ram into each other and see who would, like, fall off. That's awesome. <laughs> so that's fun. Huh. Yeah. Good times. Interesting. Huh. And there's nothing better when you're sitting out on the lake you know, sitting out on the water to have something. Oh, yeah. Like, like Rob and I, we've had the uh, key lime uh, pie sours. We've had the lemon meringue pie sours out there. I don't recommend the cherry crap. I do. Okay. It's very good. Okay. It's delicious. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, Paul, yeah. rate, rate us. All right. So I'm going to go number three, cherry pie crap. Medicine is not great. Um, delicious. And then number two. He's going back for more. I know. You want some more of this? I got three more in here. Wow. Um, number two, I'm gonna go summer shandy. Even though I'd probably grab that more, just but I like. You don't find the Hogren as much. No, you have to look. You do. I did. I, I, I like that. Look. I like that <laughs> flavor, um, and I yeah, I I like that beer. The Lineys I'll grab just because it's cheap and you could buy a big pack of them. It's just you know you're working out back and. Good drink. Oh, come on. You should be hitting the twisted tea (laughs) if you want to get jacked up. Yeah, Yeah, that's true. (laughs) All right, so that's mine. Josh, you're up. Um, Well, it's definitely not cherries. It is cherries. But you, you, you knew that going. On. I, did, I did. I I knew picking it. I was like, I'm losing this one, but I'm gaining three cherries that I'm taking home. Yes. <laughs> um, it, it, the the cherries are um, do do delicious. It it just the smell has, has a cherry, but then you can taste like the pie crust. The taste Vanilla, you can smell the yeah. Uh, yeah. It, and I just it's weird. Um, He's, you just drank more. I did. Um, He's into it. It's yeah. just not good. It's Cherries true. are just not. Cherry, the cherry flavor yeah. is just not there. And I will say it does taste like a cherry. Mercy, 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 yeah. cherry but it's, it's gross. Um, I'm going to go. I'm going to fall Paul on this one. The, the Latin Kugel is good. Um, like I said, I'm not, a, I'm not the biggest lemon fan, but it's not a bad. Yeah. Like, I don't hate lemon. Yeah. I don't want a lemon cookie. <laughs> give me a cookie. Don't give me a lemon cookie. It's lemon gross. bar. Uh, no one lemon bar either. <laughs> um, so, uh, you know, I get that. Um, but it is a very good beer. Um, I've had it for years. Like I said, my, my pops just found out about it. And he was like, hey, have you ever heard this? And, and he, I mean, he always butchers the name. It's yeah. Like, Learn, learning cookie. Cur- cur- yeah, cur- it's like, have you ever had a learning cookie? What? <laughs> a learning cookie? It's like a summer shady? What? <laughs> summer like, shady. It, it's just like, oh, a lining kugel, summer shandy. Oh, yeah, those are fine. Oh, man, I just have, well, they're so good. Oh, good, Dad. Well, okay, good. Good luck. Um, <laughs> But I, I do like the whole garden, and the whole garden is, um, that is summer, like that, like, I want to be in a hops garden and something and just sitting at a table and just... Did you say a hops garden mm-hmm. full of hops? Mm-hmm. Hops are delicious. In beer. No. In reason. They no. smell interesting. In they reason. Good, actually. Like if you like take them and... Uh-huh. Oh, like the commercial? That's, that's IPA. 
in the, in a glass. So if you put that in liquid, you'll have an IPA. You do like this has a hoppy flavor. Yeah. Oh, um, does it? It does. Yeah. Maybe to you. Maybe to you guys. Yeah. No, but it, not not that not that this is the um, uh, twelve sixty five from left hand. <clears throat> um, you know the European pilsners or whatever have a little more. Huh. Uh, but. That's a style. Like IPA is like, how can I punch you in the face with a pine tree? Yeah, and you're like, this you is looking disgusting. the forest floor. Yeah, it's gross. Yeah. Um, I'm into it, but no, like, uh, yeah, cool. like the, the the whole garden is like, oh, it is time to hang out, enjoy the heat, have some friends, like we we're doing tonight. Mm-hmm. Like you know, we had a bunch mm-hmm. of people out the, on the um, patio table. Yeah, just you know, we had the fan on. It was it was like eighty something. It was perfect. It's too so, hot. No. Too hot. <laughs> All right, Anson. All right. This is going to be a tough one. Two of these I've never had. So uh, I thought I'd have Wait, you've Ho never Garden. had a Hogarden? I, I thought I had, but tasting it, like, that's a very distinctive taste. Um, so I'm going to rank them like this. Um, let's go Line and Kugels 3. Mm-hmm. Um, I do like it. I think the rat, like, I think something more stronger on the lemon sure. side. Yeah. It needs to be even more, like more. amp it up. Ugh. Uh, the Hogarth, like a weld works, <laughs> like a summer. It shandy. needs to be a lemon s- sour pie. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> milk <laughs> sugar, milk sugars. Um, the Hogarth at number two. I think that the uh, that like c- going back to it, I can taste. I think that coriander. It's like woo, like right up front. Yeah. Um, and uh, it is interesting. It, it's kind of a little, uh, like, heavy, if it makes mm-hmm. sense. Like, like on a hot summer day, like, I might feel like that's actually pretty heavy where the shandy is so light that you could, like, drink 20 of them and yeah. just feel fine. If I drank two of these, I'd, I'd, I'd be, like, feel weighed down, I think. Mm, I can, I can uh, get that. But the taste is super interesting, and I like that. No. And um, I'm going to go with the sour kind of. Genre <laughs> slash cherry pie it sour. Was cherries, yeah. um, this is something that I would because uh, I have enjoyed Weldworks on a paddleboard in the middle of like ninety five degrees, yep. and you kind of like dip in the water, get back out, and you're like, I want something cold to drink, and that, that's, I think I think a sour is it's the spot. So we need to do a show and find <laughs> cherry flavor that Anson doesn't like. No, oh, if, if it's too medicine-y, um, I don't like. And I actually don't like maraschino all that much. And oh. this this doesn't taste like maraschino to me. Yeah. I uh, mean, I, I still think we need to find cherries. But the you. Roy Rogers and like the uh, the Seven Up, what's the Seven Up called? The Shirley Temples. Yep. When I was a kid, man, it was, it, it was, like, it was like I want a cherry Coke and just like just like jam that well, crap I loved, in there. I loved uh, cherry Pepsi. Yeah, which makes no sense. I like I like the ones where like if you go to a restaurant they like they pour like the roses syrup uh-huh. into it r- rather than just have it on you know the fountain yeah because then you're just like ooh syrupy cherry goodness. reminds me of Gunther Tooties yeah yeah they're yeah. gonna get a Gunther Tooties in Parker yeah that's no, uh-huh. right yes yeah yeah the old village inn that went away what right um right um, off of um. Like way down mm-hmm. south, yeah, mm-hmm. it's gonna be a Gunther Tooties. Yeah, yeah. it's supposed They're to calling be here. It tooties. It, it's supposed to be here uh, spring of twenty two. Yeah, what? It hasn't changed. It's I did not. There's know a supply that. chain issue right now. Yeah, I'm gonna text my brother. He's gonna be so mad. Why? That he moved to Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> he he lo- like he yeah. has an unnatural love for Gunther Tooties. That's no. why as every a time we went there. Yeah, no. The every time he's in town. Like Stacy gets super pissed because she's like, he's gonna take us to Gunther Tooties. Like, why can't we go try like good food, like regular food, like new food? Every time he's here, does he really Gunther Tooties? No, and every time. Where every is there time. Gunther Tooties? Uh, we ended up going to the one up north. It's like yeah, there's like one I twenty five and one hundred twentieth, something like that. It's like the only one left because the one in uh, Greenwood Village is gone. Yep. Yep. And, uh, and the one in uh, off of Evans or in downtown Denver. Or yeah. That one's gone off Colorado Boulevard. Well, he'll, he'll know about the one yeah. coming at Parker because he does listen. Hey. Does, does he, he really? Now he knows. He does, yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. I had him. Yeah. Do you remember me? Trudy's. He's like, I hate that kid. <laughs> I, I would have thrown him off a cliff. 
All right. Anson, well, how do we find you on socials? I'm still shocked on this whole... <laughs> at uh, Young Anson on Instagram. What? Why, Gunther? Too so, many? like, and he always gets the same thing. It's always the tenders with the fries. And then you he'll... You can get a tender anywhere. I, I don't know. And then he'll get, like, he, he loves the hot fudge Butterfinger malt. Okay. But they stopped doing the hot fudge. Like, they just don't carry it anymore at the restaurants. So they'll, so they'll do like chocolate syrup and he's like, oh, it's not as good. But um, I don't know. Just every time he's in town. Chicken we, tenders. Chicken tenders. That makes zero sense. Yeah, I don't know. The, the, I, I, Adam, you got to email me on this one. Like, you got to explain yourself <laughs> or tweet us or something. I think it's, I think it's a nostalgia e- thing. Email Gunther Tooties at yeah. Through That Show. Yeah, I, I just think it's a nostalgia thing. Like, sure. Like, uh, I don't know. I mean, I get it, but I, I, I don't yeah, get it exactly. at all. Yeah, exactly. Like, like I could take him to like nine hundred places that, Slim that, that, that he's never had. Yeah. They're amazing. Um, but no, let's go cut the duties. If Casa Bonita is open, he'll want to go to Casa Bonita. Well, I'll go with you on that one. Yeah, especially <laughs> all, the, now, all day now with Matt and uh, what? Well, yeah, now yeah. it's going to be. Oh, uh, but now the food might be good. Matt, that's just going to ruin, ruin it. Yeah. <laughs> Watch the food is amazing, and the sofa pias are going to suck. No. <laughs> <laughs> We're totally oh, gonna be flip this script. Yeah. <laughs> Ruin a Colorado classic. Oh, I'm gonna burn it down if that happens. Hey, no, 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 no. We don't talk like that. Okay. All right. Well, you can find us top three dot show, and then um, I'm at Paul Procise everywhere. Um, Josh tweeted a thing today, so find that. Yeah. All right. I, I may have to like go and find it. Did you have a Twitter account? Huh? Yes, he does. Adam does. Yeah. yeah. I may have to like just directly. Oh. At, can you tweet someone? Yes. Directly? Okay. Yep. Oh I don't know. This man. Idiot. You're like the one of the best techie guys I know, in the world. But when it comes to social media, I absolutely don't care and don't know. But you use like Slack and stuff, right? Sure. Uh, yeah, it's a Slack. It's now. similar. Can, yeah. No, it, it, it's just similar to that, where you can like at somebody and then say like yeah. at Adam Young. Mm. Why do you like got their two so much? That's weird. Try. I mean, have to try something better. I'm, I'm so my mind is so blown right now. <laughs> but but on you know this what? One. It's so, such a random one to like. So like the very first time I ever had canes was out in Ohio. He's like, you have to try this tender place. And I was like, chicken tenders, whatever. And we went to canes, and I was like, this is pretty damn good. Yeah, sure. And then we started getting canes here, and I was like, okay, I get it. Like if I had to choose between the two, it would be canes all day long, over Gunther two D's, right. whatever. So it's like he he has he likes better things. I just think it's the nostalgia of the place. It's gotta of be. being berated by crappy I what you want. Right, yeah. Oh, okay. This is not how things were in the past. I don't care. What do you want? Yeah. <laughs> I just would love to just yeah. oh. All right. Well, blow well to next time guys. We'll see you later. Bye. Drink, drink Bye. some cherry. Oh. Cherry. Cherry pie. Oh. Sour. Go. Go. Legit. That's legit. That's legit. It, it, legit. I'm legit going back to the crab. It legit. Like, I will legit. Like a legit. That was legit. Yeah.